What's going on guys, it's Anchor Saverton 15 and today I'm going to show you how to make a website for free. Today I'm going to be showing you using WordPress, some of, some of you might have heard it already, some might not. It doesn't really matter if you heard it or not. When I uh, first found out, I've never heard of it. And it's a really popular website not just for making websites but for blogging and all that type of stuff so yeah you're gonna want to go to google and type in wordpress okay and it should be the first result wordpress.com Okay, then this page should come up. Um, obviously, you're not gonna click on Get Started here. Okay, and this page should come up. Now I'm actually gonna make a website so I can show you exactly what you would see. So. So let's do a uh, email I've already done. And you're going to want to get rid of all of that, actually. So there's an Angus Davidson Tiffany, I'd say, I don't know, Angus Davidson example. Okay, and that is there. And then you just want to make a username, so that's already done. Um, just make up a password. Okay. And you want to do that again. Okay. And then type in your regular email address. So I'm not actually going to use my real one, I'm just going to use a fake one. Okay, and then it 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 will it will try and brag you into getting pay, or paying for it for quite a lot of money, but obviously this is the I'm showing you how to do it for free, so obviously you click on create blog. Okay, type in your first name and then last name. And then you want to click on save profile. Okay, and then it will say it's been sent to that email. Now, that is an email I do actually have. So, if you're doing this now, go to your email. I'll just pause this video so you can do that. Okay, once you've activated it from your email, this page will come up. So it says starter from, there you go. And then it'll come up with all these thumbnails of all the examples that you can use. I'm not going to go on those, so I'll just go, no thanks, I'll just stick with the default theme for now. Okay, and then this page will come up. It might take quite a long time to load, because it's loading quite a lot of stuff and this is your main page, home page, or you know, the dashboard, you can always go back to it from there or there okay um, and then this shows what's on your website, so how many posts you got, how many pages etc, it's got a starter video but you won't need to watch that and then your and then you can you know play around with it. So then you're going to want to go on th uh, themes. Okay. 
and then you want to better scroll down you can choose any of these you want and if you want that you can just click on activate or you can preview it however I'm going to show you my favorite one which is quite far down there are a countless number of themes so if you if you don't like any of these you can just keep scrolling there's loads of categories as well right in fact what we're going to do is because I can't find the example I'm just going to use one of the most simple ones which is literally right there I just saw it here we go piano black so you just want to click on activate and then let it load okay and then it's activated you can go into all these themes but let's just click on visit site okay and this is exactly what you, you know you should get you should ha you should have this tab because you would have signed in as well you would have had an account and this is basically it this is all your categories don't worry about all of that I'll I'll sort that out and help you okay firstly what you want to gonna do is go back uh, from where you were and then you're going to want to go on dashboard okay and then you want to click on uh, page one and then you're going to go on about so this would be your first page so what I did for mine was I made two tabs so every time I made a new, uh, I don't know, correction or anything like that, I can just refresh it and compare it. Okay. So that would be your page one about. If you want to make a new page, it's there. So let's just get rid of that. I don't know, really random. And then you wanna you can preview it, but you wanna just click on update or move to trash, put what you want. I've I uh, just put about my website and you wanna click on update. Okay, and then that would have updated itself and there you go and here's the example so share you can share this twitter facebook like it comment all of that stuff okay uh... most people will be using websites for the video so i'm just going to jump into that really quickly you want to go and click on new posts and this isn't, this isn't just for a video this can be for picture blog quote link but obviously click on video and you want to uh, you want to go to YouTube and get your get your video so we'll do that right now actually I'll just get a video only post your content because if you post other people's content they can you know they can you know sue you they can report you to uh, YouTube and they can just basically just don't do it because it's not a good idea Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to click on my newest video, obviously my new website. Okay, and then you want to click on the, don't click on this, yep, yeah, there you go. You want to click on the, uh, the full link, not when you go on Video Manager. And, you, and then you want to go on that. Okay, let's just pause that so that doesn't make sound. Okay. 
and then call it whatever you want. I'll just call it my new website. Put up what you want and then fetch video. So it will come up with a tag. You can add tags there or close it. And then you'll click on publish video. And then you can view it. So we're just going to do that now actually. And on your home page, it will come up instantly. And you, um, anyone in the world will be able to view it. And that is the basics of making a website for free. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.